Hi, so this is going to be a tray for a dinosaur world. So I'm going to start with just a piece of orange felt and we're going to make a volcano. So I've just got a plant pot upside down and a cone bit of paper on top. Then I'm going to tuck in a piece of old felt to make it look like a volcano. Right, so I've just tucked that in and that's made it look in the cone shape and I'm just going to add a rough bit of orange felt to look like uh, lava. So the next little bit we're going to do is make a swamp area uh, outline with some stones. There we go, so that's the outline of our swamp and what we're going to use for the swamp is our tried and trusted bag of green kinetic sand. This is the activity that just keeps on giving in our house. Um, it always engages. So we're going to put that in the middle as the, sw as the swamp. So there we go. Made the best effort to make it look like a swamp there. So I've got a little plastic tree I'm going to put in to make it look a bit like a, a swampy plant. And a couple of snakes I'm going to hide actually in the swamp for them to discover. So what we're going to place over here is some uh, glass stones. They're mostly grey, some gold. So we just add a nice different element over here. So I'm just going to spread those out. There we go. So I'm just going to place some, I've got some uh, nice little bits of smooth wood I'm going to place down here. These I imagine they could build some little dino caves <clears throat> and things with, just like a bit of driftwood to use their imagination with. Have a couple of leaves to place around. Then have some artificial leaves, just going to place around the swamp, make it look a bit more wild. Then I have these nice shiny black rocks I'm going to use around the base of the volcano. They look a bit volcanic. Add some different textures to the clay. Okay, so now I think it's time to add some dinosaurs. adding a couple of other little things and pretend they're prehistoric creatures. So I think we're nearly done there. I'm just going to pop a couple of yellow flowers around the edge of the swamp. I'm going to put a couple of twigs in there to build with. And I have a couple more offcuts of orange I'm going to tuck behind the volcano in case they want the lava to I'll just pop it outside the tray in case they want the lava to flow further. So there we go, a mini dinosaur world with swamp and volcano. Thank you for watching. Please hit the bell and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.